so I think I've decided this uh, this video that I'm going to do uh, about building a forge with, with minimal to little to work with, scavenged items mainly, I think I'm going to do a medieval style portable forge. And uh, one thing I learned in biology is form dictates function, so whatever you find is what you're going to work with pretty much. And uh, what I found today, or yesterday rather, was this shipping container that's made out of, looks like about a uh, eight inch by one inch uh, boards on the sides and the ends. Now the bottom is useless. It's kind of a particle board and useless for anything. It'll be, it'll be burned or otherwise discarded. But I'll take this apart and I'm gonna use this for my firebox, the part that, uh, that you actually build the forge into. And I haven't decided yet if we're going to go with a scavenged uh, cast iron pot like made out of a, a brake drum or something. Maybe you'll see that one in the shot there, I'm not sure. Or if we're going to go uh, kind of Viking and use clay to pack in there to make the thing. And I'm, I'm thinking probably uh, probably clay, but it depends on the time I have to go out and harvest it. Another thing with that, you don't have clay in every area. And uh, you do pretty much have a, a, a scrap yard somewhere with, it, with, it, with a brake drum laid in it because there's cars on, on in every town. But I'm going to use this for the firebox. Uh, I'm not sure how yet. I just know I'm going to cut a long piece for the long sides and a short piece for the short sides out of each side and make a box. And then just go from there and see what I have. I'm thinking that I'm going to make it the length that I want it to be tall. And there's a reason for that. And you'll see in the future that I'm hoping to make this portable enough that I can actually put legs on it that will fold up and it can be carried like a suitcase. But we'll see. See how the weight turns out on it. See if it's even carryable like that. If not, it may end up with wheels on it. We'll see. But first find, first thing I'm starting with is this. I'm going to make that box. And once I get it cut up, and I'll spare you the, the saw sounds and all that. Uh, I'm also doing this. As you can see, I'm dirty as usual. At the same time that I'm uh, trying to forge a cook, cookware set. So it'll be pieces at a time. This is what we're starting with. And we'll get back to you. Wish me luck.